Florida, 57% of the Latino vote went for Obama. Four years ago, 56% went to Bush. That is a major, major shift. The fact is, is that Latinos are all over the country. They provided, they're part of Virginia's victory, and not just the Southwest. Frankly, in North Carolina, how close that race was, there were about 30,000 Latino registered voters. It really um, is a flexing of muscle that has never before really been seen. And hopefully it's going to provide the kind of political space for uh, focus on issues, not just immigration, but frankly, education and investment in human capital. But the thing with the Hispanic voter particularly is the, the intensity and hostility of the immigration debate really woke up a lot of people and just uh, Latinos have always underperformed in registration and actually coming out to vote among all other groups by significant gaps depending on the state anywhere between 8 to 15 points underperforming uh, and the immigration debate just served to motivate and politicize a population that says no I, I'm gonna have to register I'm gonna have to raise my voice and they showed it and one of the big challenges for the next president is what's gonna happen on on the immigration debate, because there will be a lot of um, first-time naturalized citizen voters who engaged and want something done on that particular issue. Do you think Congress is finally ready to tackle that? Well, uh, we certainly, I mean, speaking as someone who does a lot of work on immigration reform, I certainly hope so. Um, and, and look, taking a look at that political map, there should be more of an appetite I told my Republican colleague on election night, because I was doing election night commentary on Univision, and I said, what Republicans should do to ensure that Latinos do not become Democrats for life is they better help pass immigration reform so they could come back in 2010 and 2012 and say that Republicans help, help do this. Because if they don't, um, they, they might really be the a minority party for a very, very long time.